Michael. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So no, he's not in the building? I I'm not. What do you know? I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. Today's video takes us to Lansdale, Pennsylvania with a stop at the post office where we find Jessica, aka Honey Boo Boo. Now, I don't know if this is one of her old videos or if she has ventured back out into the world of frauditing. But it's good to watch, as it's never premiered on this channel before. So let's all sit back, watch, have a good laugh, and most of all, <laughs> enjoy! Hey guys, what's up? This is Ghetto Rebellion, and we were at the Lansdale Post Office in Lansdale, Pennsylvania. Let's get into it! <laughs> Sorry, I had to say it. Now this is Jessica. And Jessica readily admits she has mental issues. She's on medications. So why is she doing this? Because she wants to bring freedom to the masses. Freedom that we already have, Jessica? You are crazy, aren't you? A few moments later. And then see if I can find picture seven. Ooh, there it is. Really right. And there we are. Photographs. For news, advertising, or commercial purposes, you could read that yourself. It seems like everyone who reads it interprets it a different way. So I don't even know what to say about that. The post office has to get its act together because while Poster 7 may be looked at that way, yeah, the website does not look at it that way. It says what? It says, you cannot depict any postal service employee, customer, security, camera, or cover of mail. That's the next to the last line in the second paragraph. A few minutes later. Why can't they have another person jump on the register? Imagine having a life so devoid of any meaning at all that you stand around in the post office for half an hour with your camera. Unbelievable! More moments later. I have to drop something. Here, do you want to use tap? We just need one for God. And it's sewing. See the little sewing? Right here. Oh, so move that one in there. From you, your name. Oh, so I have to scan that in my mind. And you can tell Jeff because I think he knows my number right here. Yeah, I'm going to tell someone. I will tell him. Jeff, where's my name? Right. Because they're going to give you a receipt that you returned it. Yeah. Yeah. I'd be scared to just leave it. I don't know. Hi. How are you doing? <laughs> it was almost a pass. <laughs> I told you Jessica was off. Now what in the hell is she laughing about? Well, she's crazy. What can I tell you? Called the police on me because I have a camera. Did we get good views last time? Huh? Did we get good views last time? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Awesome. Mm. Do you know how many it's at? Huh? Do you know how many it's at? No, I don't know. How many cops are they going to send for a camera? Three, huh? Mm. Hmm? I said, what are we recording? Oh, it's a constitutionally protected activity. And it's just to like put it out there that, you know, all citizens have the right to record according to the First Amendment of the Constitution. Okay, but what are you recording? Um, the public servants doing their business. People working at the post office? What's that? The people that are working at the post office? Yes, sir. I'm a political activist on YouTube. I bet your mom is so proud of you, isn't she, Jessica? You're a civil rights activist. You're like a freedom fighter. Oh boy, your mama really proud of you, Jessica. 
strong. Okay. Oh, that goes on What did they do? They give you the wrong stamps? You asked for Santa Claus? No. They you fucking leprechaun? No. <laughs> they didn't do anything wrong. Can't you get your stamps at the, at the uh, market? The supermarket? You need a receipt? She doesn't need a receipt. She just puts it in there. There's all the time. We'll go out for delivery today, okay? But, so what's the same? We're not allowed to be out here right now, okay? You're not, not allowed to be out there? Yeah. Hmm. I hope not. All <laughs> oh, because of the camera? <laughs> I think so. Oh, oh my God. You didn't close the envelope. I mean, because you're recording, they can't come out. You're just recording or you're getting stamps? Yeah, I'm getting stamps. Did you want them today? What's that? You wanted your stamps today? Stamps? Oh. <laughs> okay. Have a good day. Bye -bye. Good luck. We all know the frauditors are clowns and their recording has nothing to do with the First Amendment because if you really wanted to buy some stamps, you'd go to the self-serve vending machine in the lobby, buy your stamps, and go home. It's called a First Amendment audit because the First Amendment of the Constitution gives us the right to free press. And most people don't even know what free press is. So we're kind of worried that, you know, these rights are just fading. And if we don't exercise them, they're kind of like a muscle. If we don't exercise our rights, they disappear. Okay. So, so we're trying to keep that from happening. Buying stamps needs to be recorded? No, it's the post office. Because they receive our tax dollars and the public servants get paid with our tax dollars. And as such, we're allowed to come in and see what kind of job they do. Like I was before they served us, we've been waiting for 30 minutes in line. This is why Jessica failed so miserably at fraud. She just listened to other auditors and what they said and did. She doesn't realize that the tax dollars don't pay for the postal service. Doesn't realize what the hell she's babbling about. Post office is primarily self-funded, Jessica. Check it out. Talk to them. Yeah. Um, so all they're just asking, they were, obviously, if you're in the lobby, oh, that's I'm okay. You know, we've been over this before. Right. I was here with you. Yep. It's more so just if you're impeding. They just don't want you impeding. So if you can just stand out of the way, you can record. Yeah, I'm trying to buy stamps. Okay. Right. And they refuse service, so. Okay. Well, sadly, I can't stop them from refusing service. So. Right. Okay. If that's what it is and they don't want to then even though the yeah. rules and regs state i'm allowed to be here no no no. i'm saying like you can be here and record they just if you're not doing official business which i'm not saying you're not right i can't speak for what you're doing okay um, yeah i'm trying to buy doing? stamps okay yeah so if that's all you're trying to do and you want to wait until they come you're more than welcome to but okay i mean obviously i can't tell them to come with the window right it's up to them to <laughs> right <laughs> Okay. All right. Thank right, you. Can you. No, thank you no. so much. Right. What's your name? Uh, Thompson. What's Thompson. Your... I was in your last video. Okay. Yeah. I'll just get it. The answer from that. Right. Everyone thought you were so cute and nice, so thank oh. you. <laughs> OMG, Jessica's flirting with this cop. I think she's got a love connection for him. What do you good people think? Man, the only way that's going to look good to you is in a dark bar after some furious drinks. <laughs> Hopefully they don't mind my tattoos this time. Okay. <laughs> Have a good day. Stay safe. What is happening? Two party consent state, and I do not consent to being recorded. Actually, there's no expectation of privacy in public, sir. You're already on camera everywhere you go. I'm positive. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame? Sad. What's a shame? What's mm -hmm. sad? Like, I, I understand. Because you can't wrap your head around it. It's no, sad, and it's like you said. Stop it. I understand the First Amendment <laughs> right. Right? But I don't understand what buying stamps has anything to do with it. Like, it's the post office. Okay, so they're making ten dollars an hour to sell stamps. Why are you gonna give them a hard time? Like, let them not, sell stamps. A camera isn't oh, a okay. hard time, sir. There's cameras everywhere we go. Right. Very true. <laughs> I'm gonna go forge your way. Thank you for joining the movement. What is Another thing that Jessica never learned was, oh, hey, yeah, you can film in public. That's not a problem. But then taking someone's image and posting it on someplace like YouTube, that's against terms of service, Jessica. Oh, dearie me. Your YouTube handle. I'm just so curious. <laughs> yeah, you could be curious all you want, sir. So you're not going to tell me your YouTube handle, but you're happy to record people in public. Just 
disrupt people's lives, right? Disrupt people's lives? How? I feel very disrupted. Because I'm the sixth camera in the room? I need to get back to work. So do I. Right? And you're sitting here stopping me from... I'm not stopping anything, sir. They're stopping. Please don't Stop blame me for good. them shutting down. So you can pause your camera for a minute, sell me some stamps, be on my way, you can record. You can talk to them all you want, this isn't my fault. It is your fault, because you're the one recording for no reason. There's already six cameras here, right? So you said? Mm-hmm. So what's a seventh? Exactly, what does it matter? It matters. Sir, you're trying to have a debate with a crazy woman. Look at her eyes, she's crazy. Out of her bloody mind, crazy. Me, matters to them. This poor gentleman, how long have you been here? Uh, 20, 20, 20 minutes, probably. Here 20 minutes. So you're trying to prove a point. You're making everybody's life harder for no reason. No, we were waiting here in 30 minutes before this ever happened. Are you refusing cars? Are you refusing service to everyone, sir? Could tell them I'm outside, they could serve you. Okay. Well, there you have it, good people. You see why Jessica wasn't too successful, right? Yeah, she's a bloody idiot. Now, I don't know why she's uploading these old videos. Now, this could be a new video. I don't know, but I think it's an old video. And maybe she wants to get back into the game. Who knows? But at any rate, if you enjoy watching stupid people do stupid things on my channel, please subscribe. Because as this video proves, there's no end to the stupidity in the world. Especially when it comes to frauditors on YouTube. Check out my latest channel, Dr. Dave Frauditor Terminator. It features the four fabulous fools of frauditing. That's right, Goat Boy, a.k.a. Boom Boom Boy. Man Bun Lana. Rusty boy. And don't forget baby girl Zach, who's recently been declared indigent. <laughs> yeah, right. And Dr. Day's main channel has over 6,000 video uploads for your viewing pleasures. Jessica needs to find a job. A real job, Jessica. Can you do that? Probably not. Cheers to that. I've actually studied English, and uh, I have a, over a 400 level education in English. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? Really, no reason I'm really, to have. I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm gonna arrest you for trespassing yeah, in a minute. On um, public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave, and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's jealous. She's right in my face, guys. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, you to record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the do. law. Oh, is that like a law? It's against the law. Oh, what law is that? Funny, because I've never heard about that. I pay for that uniform, I pay for that car, I'm the taxpayer, right? You work for me, right? You're just a little guy. You're just a little guy. You work for me. You are a public servant. You are a public servant. You work for me. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. You assaulted me. She assaulted me. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. Take a swing. Take a swing. You'll go to jail. Go ahead, put your hands on me. Put your hands on me. Salami hala handula. Ignorance of the law is not an excuse. I'm being forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby, so. So, if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. You want to do it, you let's do it. Let me know, buddy. Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm gonna do you hit me. Okay. Sir, okay now you now take my picture. Now. I don't know you. I got a broken shoulder. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, you know, we need help getting hotels. I have been putting in job applications, and it's. I, I don't know any job where you walk up to it, fill out the application, and they hire you right on the spot. She spit me on my face right now. She spit in my face. Right now she spit in my face. I got a camera. $60, guys. 
is what we're trying to raise. So if you can help out, contribute towards it, feel free to donate, guys. I won't ever ask for money on this channel again. You touch my phone, you can't touch my phone. Okay, you touch my phone. Why did you touch my phone? She touched my property. Hey, what's up, guys? So we're here at the America's Best Value. Um, we're trying to get a room. I'm asking for help. Please, guys. I need y'all's help. You can't solicit a trespass, bro. You just solicited a trespass. I asked her what she wanted. No, you can't say, do you want them trespass? You can't use that line. She touched my phone. I got it on a video. I want to arrest her. I want to arrest her. I want you. You're going to go to jail now. <laughs> <laughs> We're a little low on funds, guys. Uh, so I want to make a quick video. If there's any way you guys can help out, uh, we're trying to get a room. I'm gonna pay you too, okay? Right. We're done already. I got you now videos. This is a public sidewalk. She touched me. She touched my phone, okay? okay. This is an expensive phone. This is almost 1200 okay? <laughs> Mrs. Potato's breaking my balls, everyone. <laughs> She's straight up breaking my balls. I will never beg you for it. I won't beg nobody for nothing. Please don't touch me. Step sir, outside. Sir, sir, what are you doing? I, I what are you doing? Donate to the PayPal if you can help out. If you can't, I understand. PayPal link below. So if any of you would like to send me some money to help me out, I could greatly use it, but I'm not begging you for it. So just leave. I live here. Listen, you have a bipolar problem. You're bipolar. You're having a bipolar episode. Everybody hit the like button. Everybody hit the like button. You threatened me in my room like a little bitch. And if you want to take it to the street, we can do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. So I was cutting the grass with a pair of scissors, just tidying up the, instead of using a weed whacker, sometimes I use scissors because I'm really fast. Keep your distance, bitch. Keep you your swing, distance. Then, then go ahead. Keep you your distance, me, bitch. Me and that's your ass. Keep your distance, you bitch. I will sue you. You can sue anybody you want, anytime you want. Okay. If, if, if they do, I will sue him first because he's in charge. You're in charge, right? You're the guy in charge. You're the one who gets listed on the lawsuit. 